Hey y'all, it's me, Yatsai Glatte. Welcome back to How a Stylist Packs for a two week Euro trip with three destinations, one wedding, and a carry on. So, just to go a bit more in depth to this outfit, so this outfit that I'm walking through is a silk kimono, which is gorgeous. I'm actually just going to throw it on right here. One of the things I love about this is it actually goes with everything, like it even goes with what I'm wearing now. Again, what I like about this is you can use it as a light, like throw on type jacket if it's, again, it's silk, so it's not gonna really keep you warm, but you know, in the nighttime, it would be great to just throw on while you're in town, especially because we're going in June, so it'll be warm. All right, so the next part is this foundation set. So I love this set, it's super cute. Um, so it's this tank, a square neck tank and a low cut back of it. The back is a bit lower. It's super comfortable and very supportive, so I don't wear a bra with it. And then you have these shorts. So the shorts are great. They're like longer. So if you're someone like me whose thighs rub, they're great for summer. <laughs> and again, they're cotton, they're stretchy, so you can't go wrong. So what I love about this whole look is that it's super easy to pull off, right? Like anyone can do it. You have shorts, you have a tank, you have a light kimono robe to throw on top. And that in itself is the look. Now um, to like go into more depth, let's think about shoes. All right, so when it comes to traveling light, that means you don't get to take as many shoes. What I like about this set and what I've chosen so far is that I could easily wear both that silk dress in the previous video and these and the current outfit with these chucks. They're really cute. I actually really love these shoes. Very comfortable to walk in. And again, we're going to be in Europe, so lots of walking, right? Another option is these chunky sandals that I have. Um, these definitely go with the foundation set that we're just looking at. Um, I don't know how well it goes with the silk dress. Actually, it's behind me. So you can see the silk dress and these. They're not the worst, but they're definitely not the best. So that's something to consider, right? Because we're using a carry-on. Um, so there's not that much space for shoes. So the shoes I'm gonna wear to Europe will be what I normal, like what I'm wearing on the plane. So like sneaker wise, I'll be wearing those in transit, right? So sandal wise, I have these. I also have another pair that we can uh, option out um, in the next video as we go through the outfits. But definitely these are a contender for shoes. So again, for bags, um, since I'm already bringing the Telfi, I'll probably stick with this. Um, I am potentially thinking about using like a crossbody or like fanny pack type bag. You know, I'm not trying to say that Europe is full of pit pockets, but there's definitely people that can rob you more, especially in touristy areas. So we'll see about bags, um, but this is definitely coming. So at least I know this works with the foundation set. So let's just put it all together so you can get a good idea of how this works. Y'all, if you're watching these videos thinking, I totally need help with my closet, my wardrobe, my clothing, well, fear not. I've put the link to my personal styling services in the description box below. I help the she's, the he's, the they's, and the them's, and I sure I can hook you up with a great style. All right, y'all, thanks for sticking around. We have plenty more outfits to pack and of course to see how it all comes together. And we haven't even touched on accessories in terms of jewelry. We haven't touched on um, undergarments yet. So all in all, uh, we have more to do and I hope to see you again. Ciao.